Yes. Uh, let's let's first do questions on this subject, and then I'll get to you. Okay. Stay tuned. Yes. So going off of that, the former president has indicated that he would likely not sign a national abortion ban. What do you make of this in contrasting that with all Look at everything he said over the years. Look at everything he said over the years, proudly bragging that he put the people on the Supreme Court who repealed Roe v. Wade. No one believes him. Everyone knows what he's going to do. Yes. Yes. It is utterly amazed, I was pleasantly amazed when we saw the polling data that over 65 percent of Americans had heard of Project 2025 and three quarters of those knows it's very bad. It's amazing. It's really, it's really hit home. And that's why it came up in the debate and that's why Trump was so defensive about it in the debate. Yes. Because this is the real, what the real, this is what Trump will do. These are his supporters. They spent months together figuring out what to do. We know that Donald Trump will turn, will just say something on a dime because he's under pressure. Everyone knows this is his plan, not what he's trying to run on right now because he knows what he wants to do is so unpopular. Yes, in the back. Is this meeting in the Montana Senate race at all? And is there a need for a change of Look, John Tester is going to win that race. Everyone knows he represents Montana very well. This is resonating in every part of the country. Last one. Um, the, the, the document says uh, hits DEI pretty hard, and, and the Treasury Department specifically, it says that it, uh, their plan is to call in every Treasury official that, that has. Uh, and I, I was wondering if, if there is a need for, if they're looking at federal. Well, we're going, to have, we're going to have five more of the ten worst next week, okay? Now you get the last question on a off-topic. Yesterday, a group of Republicans stood where you all are standing and said, basically, if Democrats don't pass the state back, they will be held to pay, especially when it comes to January 6th. Again, we know what happened a few years ago. So my question to you is, will you put it on the floor even as a standalone? And if not, what are your concerns with it? Uh, let me just say, um, we're not going to get into detailed negotiations, as we've said before. We need a bipartisan bill where everyone comes together and figures out what to do. As you've seen, the chaos in the House, because Speaker um, Johnson is trying to do this in a partisan way, guided by the far right, he's not getting anywhere. Thank you, everybody.